What's going on today, YouTube? Today we are going to be doing a little bit of ice racing in the Skyline GTR. Right now we're just currently loading it up. Got a little bit of a late start on the day. Uh, still have to get fuel for this thing and uh, whatever else. But yeah, I got four boys working on loading this thing on the trailer right now. Oh no! You guys figure it out or what? Matt's doing work. Damn, look at those Nismo rims. Those probably aren't gonna stay on there. Uh, battery. Well, towed by the Ford Runner. And look at this thing. Woo! Are you racing this thing today or what? Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be, this is gonna be exciting. Racket. Racket? Look at this spoiler though. This is what I'm looking for. This is what the GTR needs. For sure, for sure. It's the chassis mounted spoiler. Dope. And I guess this thing's supercharged. That's just what you need on ice, hey? A nice supercharged engine. Matt, good job. Lasky, good job. Yeah, this is either gonna be a really good day or a really bad day. <laughs> Holy this is an animal. Diesel. All right, we're at uh, the racetrack here. Got the car unloaded, and uh, yeah, we're gonna see how it goes. Buddy's got his drone flying up here. People are people are riding on the on the trunk or tail end. Somebody's probably gonna die today. Hopefully, it's not me. Look, this is the competition here today. We've got some Civic, some Subaru. Is this guy in his race suit here? Truck, dog. Yeah, MR2, buddy in his truck. I guess he's racing it, apparently. This is the race, I suppose. This so. is the race zone. What else we got? What is this thing? I don't even know what that is. That's a D old school V dub. And this guy, this guy's part of our crew. This hell is slammed. Let's see what happens there. Where's all the racing car parking spots at? Well, this is all supposed to be it, so. I guess we'll just be like first in line here. Yeah. We'll just go first. I'm not even driving right now, so I have zero cares in the world. This is where I'm gonna meet a car girl. I don't think the Tinder girls call it this far. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I should you probably catch some new matches out here. <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of fish. Plenty of frozen fish. Just, just, just swing a bitch. Cut kick. It's gonna be ridiculous. Oh, that torque though. Damn! Nice BRZ, bro! This thing is hella low. Yeah, that sucks. So our other stock ended up uh, not working or the connectors needed to be cleaned on it or something because uh, all we had is high beams, so we're probably gonna rip that apart and just take a quick look. Seats have their kind of normal wear and tear in it. This steering wheel has got to go though. Like I'm, we're gonna wear gloves today, but yeah, we kind of are wishing that we ended up uh, switching that out there first. Pretty cool. This is the first time that I've ever gone out here, so we'll see how it goes. Looks like there's lots of ice too, so these winter studded tires that we got should be all right. Some Nismos. Slow uh, center cap set kicking around so we put them on the rims. We'll see if they last uh, long at all here. I'm thinking there's probably gonna be one that fall fall off, but maybe they might last, so I'm hoping so. Uh, what else do we got here? Oh, we picked up some uh, tires, some studded tires. Yeah, some, what are they, Netherland tires? So, they do have some studs in them. They look pretty aggressive. So yeah, that's kind of the tread on them. They look all right, brand new, and I couldn't find anything used, so that's kind of the way we went with those. But 
uh, yeah, I'm kind of happy we ended up going stud. I kind of wanted studless, but uh, I think studs might be uh, a little bit better, a little bit nicer to, to drive on. Look at you. You look like a full-fledged Canadian. Yeah. Yeah, bud. Magic. <laughs> <laughs> now, what about you? I was a half-fledged Canadian. Half? Just a little half? Yeah, half one. So introduce yourself. Kale. Kale. I've got a blown up Celica and a not blown up FRS. Yeah. Not yet. Yet. <laughs> <laughs> Are you a little scared at all for this thing or what? No? I've done worse. Just run it how it is. Yeah, pretty sweet. And you said this thing was uh, supercharged, right? Supercharged, yeah. It died at like 200 at the wheels. Yeah. So. Sweet. Slightly less slow. All gold. Is that a genuine? Looks good. What kind of coilovers are you running on this thing? RSR. RSR. I've never even heard of that. Is that like a Japan? Yeah. <laughs> some uh, heat wrap to be extra baller. Some, some gold. And what kind of supercharger did you go with on this one? Sprintex is the brand on it. Yeah. Smaller pulley, so the boost is up a little bit. Nice setup. Cool. Thank you. It's a little bit too much power for the ice, but that's what's running today. Ah, downforce helps. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit extra weight on the back. Any issues with this kit, or just kind of straight bolted on? Nothing. Zero issues with anything on the car. I haven't been able to break it. Sweet. So far. That's a plus. Until maybe today, but yeah. I feel like it's going to be more of into a snowbank kind of break. Well, yeah. We'll see. Hope for the best. Positive thinking. Yeah. <laughs> Driver's meeting. <laughs> Look at this thing. Woo. This thing is sick. LED lights all around. This guy's got straight racing set up on this. Hey, welcome guys to Rallycross number one for 2017. Thank you all for coming. You're gonna have a great time today. We will all have a better time if we're not spending all day pulling people out of the bank. So please drive within your skill level. Rallycross is supposed to be a place where you can come and learn how to drive. If you don't know how to drive, learn today. If you do know how to drive, you probably don't learn today. <laughs> okay. Competition vehicles backed up into there. We need to keep this side of the pit road open all the way down, okay? So the trucks and trailers, move them all to the very end like these guys are, that's fine. These couple of cars need to get moved. Those couple of cars, whoever owns that red one, what the hell are you parked there for? Uh, that's me. <laughs> okay, so if you clip a cone inside of that slalom, it's worth two seconds. If you drive over this, it's worth 10. There is absolutely zero passing allowed in, in our rally crosses under our sanctioning. If you come across a car on the track as you're going around, you do not pass it. Recovery.
are currently loading up the car end of the day with the autocross slash rally racing. Take a look to the front there again. She's so tight. A little bit of snow in there. Uh, had a little uh, snow bank incident. Coming in a little, a little hot, brake fade, so. Other than that, it was, everything was pretty good. I feel like this trailer isn't crazy overkill. I just feel like we need a better setup to kind of get it mounted up. Well, it's, it's crazy overkill. You think so? This trailer? It's for carrying 14,000 yeah. pounds. So maybe we can like stack two cars on here somehow. Until you get that uh, highway wobble, right? How's that highway wobble? That was frightening. Were you scared? I was not catching this thing. <laughs> All right guys, so hopefully you guys enjoyed some of the other video that I uh, just posted there and the quality was uh, somewhat good. Long day. Yeah, I, <laughs> I think we're both pretty bagged today. It was a long day. We only got a few hours sleep yesterday. Uh, it was a mad dash this morning, so. We were late. Yeah, we, weren't even, <laughs> we were not prepared at all. So we, uh, I think. Time. Now we know what to expect. <laughs> yeah, I think I definitely, I think we both learned a few things. One. You're not dressed warm enough, like. Yeah, I should, you I should, probably should have brought a jacket. No. Just didn't cut it. Even I got kind of a little bit cool there, so. Yeah, and it was like, it wasn't even, it was warm outside. For like this time of month, oh, it was like almost summer weather. Plus eight, I think we got to. Yeah, so one thing for sure, dress a lot warmer. Buy uh, some winter boots, that's what I gotta do. Yeah, you, you're rocking these, just these shoes. Work. I got at least a Sorrells, but I got stuck out marshalling one time with no boots and yeah that was it was horrible i it felt like it was the longest time out there too because oh there's timing issues yeah there's a few little issues and stuff like that but first run of the year i think it went pretty good i'm everything this thing fucking rips like studded was for sure the way to go i was kind of a little bit debating that but no studded was the right choice there maybe even bigger studs <laughs> yeah actually i think i think our studs need to be sticking out a little further than that but uh, yeah, it'll be good. We'll uh, maybe keep you guys posted with the times. It's I think we did pretty close. Like I think what they were saying is 15, 16, and so we'll have to see if that's uh, accurate online there. But yeah, our times are really close, so we'll have to we'll have to wait till next time here. There's going to be a little bit of a tiebreaker here next time or the next few ones because it looks like we uh, are maybe somewhat have similar driving skills or pretty much neck and neck. Yeah, we pretty much both didn't really know. Well, I don't. I didn't really know what I was doing out there, so. It was, uh, I, I had tons of fun though. I, we will definitely be doing this again. I'm happy the car didn't blow up. Everything seemed to be working <laughs> pretty good. Up, yeah. <laughs> that was pretty much the main thing. Like as long as the car didn't blow up, we were, we were good. So like down below and make sure to subscribe. We did get some more parts. Take a little quick sneak peek of one of the parts that we got over here. It's a cannon. This thing is so huge. I don't know if it's even realistic to install because we're not gonna even be able to get it on the trailer. Like, let's take a look how big this thing is. Like, this thing is, Matt, put your hand up for like, just comparison on this. Look at that. This thing will eat small children and animals <laughs> and like, I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's just like ridiculous. So, that might be something that gets, Put on in the future here but for now uh yeah stay tuned and uh thanks for watching